Alright. <coughs> we recording again? Yes. Alright. Kick it off when you're ready. Oh my god. Alright, Jake. You can do it this time. I don't think I can. I believe in you. You're the only one. You gotta be, you know, you know, hey, you've done this before. Ain't no reason you can't do it again. Boing. That's true. You know, insert inspirational quote here. Hi. Do you have erectile dysfunction? That's not what I was going for. I didn't really consider that topic to be the stuff of inspiration. Why not? I don't know. The idea of that... We hit the hard-hitting topics. Apparently we do today. We do today. I was asking people, you know, what their favorite... We started this off with the first video, first question of the day ever we did was, do you like cauliflower? <laughs> and now we're sitting here talking about erectile dysfunction. No, I was just referencing myself there, not that I have ED. I was going to say, wait a second, now <laughs> I'm getting confused and scared a little bit. No, um, talking about how I can't perform under pressure. Oh. That, uh, you've, got, could, you've, got the game, you've got the gaming equivalent. Of ED right now. I've got gaming ED, ladies and gentlemen. You get GD, gaming dysfunction. I don't care. Okay. I'm, I'm done. Heck with it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dust Knuckles. Call me Johnny Dust Knuckles. Better than the other one you had a minute ago. I actually stole that joke and sent it to a friend of mine and said, Jay, you were going to adopt that name and become that. And a friend of mine actually believed me. <laughs> was oh like, my god. Like, what? He's... You're telling me this this person's name off camera. Yeah. <laughs> this person, you don't know them, like, in person. I don't. No, you've never meet them, met them in person. I Neat. never meet them. Okay. You oh never meet god, them. Oh my god, these birders, man. At least they're blue, so the name makes sense. Yeah, I did that on purpose. Jeez. So this one's a little secret boy up here. First time I ever did this level, I found that. Yeah. I'm not trying to brag or nothing, I'm just saying I did. I mean, it's a little obvious, but I mean, it's a really nice touch. But it's sad that you have to destroy that depressed looking uh, creature. Yeah, it'll make gasoline. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I put dead dinosaurs in my car and drive. It's like, man, driving a car is like uh, so metal now. Here we go. This guy is pretty cool. I always love this fight. Oh, yeah. Mole Knight is nice. Uh, hit him in the butt. Ah, here we go. I think it's like... No, I think you can actually stop this attack if you dig him up. Yeah, if you dig him out of that pile in time, then yeah, it'll... Um, yeah, cancel out the, that volcanic attack. Yeah, but I love this guy. Oh, yeah. Everybody loves a fat guy. Wow, look at that. I made him look like a pile of shit. Oh, yeah. And the moles come to get him. Or, uh, to reference another YouTuber, he went down like a bag of shit. <laughs> that is uh G Star three two one I believe. Mr. G M R G Star three two one. He does a lot of Resident Evil walkthroughs that I watch. Oh, okay. It's again, I don't know if you've ever watched him, but I have I, not. I love him. He's hilarious because he always says, Oh yeah, he went down like a bag of shit and he's <laughs> yeah, he's Australian, but it's like <laughs> he always says bag of shit and it's like that, I wanna start saying that. <laughs> Australian. That just makes me think of the joke I made up with my friends that one time. <laughs> yeah, we're not talking about that. <laughs> Wesley. Yeah, with my with my luck, <laughs> it would not end well. Not that I said it. I didn't say anything racially insensitive or anything like that. Don't. Oh, anybody. it was bad. It was racist. No, it, it was wasn't. Super racist. It was not. It was another level of racism called super racism. Uh, would that be above or below Donald Trump level racism? What, what is happening? Wow. I watched the computer the whole time. None of that happened on there, so we're still good. Yeah, but it flashed. Yeah, I don't I don't get it. It's, I don't know. Things are going weird. I'm wondering if it's just this game. 
I don't know. I don't get it, but you should head back oh, to the village. Yeah. And last, well, we're actually kind of going through this game. Yeah. And this is episode eight. And this isn't like a. I don't think this game was intended to be one of those 13-hour gaming experiences. No, I mean the first time. Well, the first time I ever sat down and played it on your PS4, which would have been the second time that I played through it. Um, I beat it in five hours in one sitting because it's such a beautiful game. Yeah, it's one that's kind of hard to stop playing once you've started. Yeah. Kind of like uh, Pringles' old old slogan, once you pop, the fun don't stop. Once you pop, you can't stop. Then it went to once you pop, the fun don't stop. Which is, uh, just, again, was thrown around as a, a huge, big, nasty sexual reference in my high school. Man, that's a lot of treasure. Yeah. I remember that. I remember, uh, the days of having to deal with that. <laughs> Hey, yo. hey, don't get me wrong, I, I don't have an issue with lewd jokes once in a while, but it's almost like oh. swearing, you know? You do it too much, you're not doing yourself or your image any favors. <laughs> yeah. No, never mind. I mean, I don't, like I said, I don't look down on people that swear or nothing like that. I just feel like... Yeah, I'm not even maybe, tall, I can't look down on hardly anybody. Yeah, yeah I mean... I never broke six foot, and then here I... Oh, crap. You're still taller than I am. Yeah, but it's like, Nick, our cousin, he just turned 13. He's already as tall as I am. And, Almost, yeah. And he's going to outgrow us. Yeah. Because neither of us ever broke six foot. And no. I know, oh, my God. I was going to say, I'd just go on with yourself. That's what I'd do. He's coming after me, did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> nah, I made it to 5'8", Jacob made it to 5'9". Because I know somebody was going to ask if I we thought, didn't just say it. I don't know. I don't know how tall I am because I remember me and Tanner uh, measured ourselves one time. And I was like... High school best friend, by the way. Oh yeah, Tanner. Love you, man. I hope you're doing good down in Atlanta. Um, yeah, why don't you just give him his address while you're at it? Oh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> but yeah. Whatever. Shut up. Uh, freaking, I can't even think of what I was saying. Talking about measuring yourself? Oh, yeah. And I was like 5'11 and a half at one point. Really? Yeah. Were you barefoot? Uh, yeah. Okay. I believe so. Oh, you I, don't, I don't know if I still am, though. That's the thing. Every time I measure myself, I'm like way off. I know. And it's like, I can't get it consistent here. And I never go to the doctor because I'm stubborn. Uh, yeah. I'd rather just home remedy myself. There's there's your question of the day. Do you like going to the doctor or do you prefer to just take How Tylenol until it that? goes away? I mean, I guess some people like going to the doctor. Some people like going to the dentist. I don't like going to the dentist just because I don't like people that close to my face staring at me with my mouth open and I'm just like, you know, I'm she, over here like, ah, and they're like, so how are you doing today? And I'm like, ah, just keep your mouth still. <laughs> I, just, I, I need you to keep your mouth open. It's like you're trying it's to like, talk. And, and then they keep asking you questions and you try to answer and you're just like, uh, uh, and it's like, keep your mouth open, please. I'm going to need you to keep your mouth open and still, please. And it's like, stop fucking asking me questions, man. It's like, make, make up your Jeez. mind. You want me to answer your questions? You want me to keep my mouth open and still? Because I can't do both. Oh, what, what was that movie with uh, that one dude? He was in the new Ninja Turtles movie. He was uh, the Falcon in the second one. Oh, you talking about. Burn. Yeah, oh, what's that actor's and, name? Uh, and he was also in Hot Rod. Babe! 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 He also <laughs> voiced Batman in the Lego movie. God, he did. <laughs> I didn't see that movie. Dark nest. No parrots. More darkness. <laughs> oh my god, he said that. The opposite of light. Yeah, that was like a song he sang in it. It was like oh Batman... God doing a dark brooding song about being an orphan and it was that oh my god <laughs> it was so stupid oh yeah i forgot i never bought this coin you flip it at people and uh it might, chance it, at riches it might drop some money it, it kind of just like bounce, yeah. bounces around and also you can um if i can catch up to it you can flip it at people oh okay if it ever is coming at you I never ever use that particular uh... I like this guy better oh yeah that bouncy ball yeah uh, so you cashed in your meal tickets I think we're good to go yeah I mean uh, I mean pretty much 
I don't I still don't think we've unlocked the catapult. Uh, we might have now that the third love, the third area is open. Yes, we have. Ah. 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 And you have to use it at least that one time. This just just leads to up here. So we're in that other town where Mr. Hat was. Mr. Hat. Mr. Hat. You gonna buy any more upgrades while you're there? Uh, I guess I'll buy this. One. I like this one. Oh, uh, where you charge up the slash? Yes. Now you have multiple ways to get that nice slash out. Don't spend all of it. Uh, you might need some for looking. the next levels. Le uh, Room, might be uh, uh, again. relic. No, I'm trying to help you put that behind you. I'm just trying to look forward. Uh, what is this? Ooh. You want to do this this episode? The Hall of Champions? Yeah, we can knock that out if, uh... Shortcut? Let's look at this. Let's kind of mess around for a little while. So, uh, what's this? Hey. I heard there's a super hidden double secret in the Hall of Champions. Where could it be? We know where it is. It's right over here! Ah! Ow. I think he's, well, <laughs> I was going to say, well, he is dead. Yeah. Looks like, I, what that, what is that? That appears to be a doe lady holding an, um, a parasol. If it's not raining, it's not an umbrella, it's just a parasol. Yeah. If it started raining, it instantly becomes an umbrella, though. Uh, that, that is an interesting thing. Oh, That's the difference. Let's between. go ahead and just skip here. The next episode we'll take on the Hall of Champions. Or should we just do... No, screw it. We'll do the Hall of Champions. Why not? With you by our side, Black Knight. Total domination. Uh, wrong witch, Jacob. Sorry, I just... I switched, like, voices eight times. Your safety is my only concern. Was that the Enchantress? Tell, Tell me the me truth. Uh, the Order, Black Knight, the Enchantress, Fool, Down, Ruinous Path, path. Tower of Fate, <coughs> Reach It. If you could change your feet, <laughs> steal uh, thy shovel. I'll steal thy face. It's the Black Knight. Hey, come here. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I can't believe that actually worked. <laughs> I'll do it again. I guess the AI had a temporary lapse of uh It's not like the AI knows what I'm doing. Yeah. They probably just programmed him to jump around. You clever devil. <laughs> Come on. Hit him! I'm trying to get that double bounce. But he keeps going like Ah, what? That Jump. didn't work. Come on, hit him! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that sound like your boy there. Yeah. Oh, he knocks it back. Ha! <laughs> like I just trip him, hit him in the butt. <laughs> yeah. That's what it looked like. Uh, I kind of wish that castle was a little bit closer and more detailed because you know we're actually nearing it now. Tis but a scratch? How come he didn't run that fast when I was fighting him? I don't know. I really don't. I haven't a clue. Yeah, that one we need the dagger for. Um, I don't think there's anything else we can do Other besides than tackle just... the Hall of Champions. Yes, and we will do that next time. Why is it nighttime? This is the Hall of Champions. A living monument to the founders of this great land, which we will elaborate on that next time. Yeah, let's call it a day for now, or a night in this case. Yeah, it's it's 11 p.m. Right Join now. us next time as we tour the Hall of Champions and find its secrets. Stick around, guys. Bye. Uh...